We are currently in the Moon Dungeon Expeditions and we are expecting something hard actually. Um, the general mechanics of the dungeon are pretty interesting. So Moon has 200% res, summons 4 totems just like the regular dungeon, the invulnerable darkly, which you can swap places with if you hit him. The only difference here is you have to actually put all the 4 totems on their glyph so you can't just put one of them you have to put all four of them it works just like the regular dungeon you hit linearly you pull them towards you however an extra mechanic here what's going to make this one harder is that at the end of your turn you swap with the nearest totem so that's gonna screw the entire placement over as well as place a glyph under the totem so then if another character swapped with it and he's gonna start his turn on the, on the glyph you will get one shot and you don't want to get one shot here um the totems uh spawns are fixed however the cells they can vary but they seem to be always nine squares away from the totem so i don't think they can be in in a wall so i think that should be fine uh these are the black glyphs um you the totems only have 500 hp so the general Tip is basically kill all of the totems turn one, so you don't have the swapping mechanics, you don't have the black glyphs. You can just kill the enemies in like five turns, and then it will they will get respawned on turn six. So if you just plan ahead, get your MP buffs up, get your placement buffs up, and you put the totems on there on turn six, then you can kill the boss on turn seven. Um, so I'm just gonna try that. Normally I try to do speed runs, like lowest amount of turns possible, three turns fights, four turns fights. This one, I'm just not going to do that because I feel like it's going to be too insane. So that's what I'm pretty much going to do. Um, just got to avoid the black glyphs. And then once the boss is uh, on the glyph, he will lose 200% rest. Only thing you need to be careful of is this Greedo. Uh, he can one-shot in CC. So I brought my MP reduction and it's rough. But good thing though, um, I trust tested this because now I know that if you do MP reduction in this uh, dungeon... You actually heal the enemy. So MP reduction is not worth using. Uh, unless the enemy is, is pretty much already full health. So I'm just going to use the MP reduction for the Greedos. And once they are gone. I technically don't need MP reduction anymore. So we should be fine from there on. Let's go. Right, if what if I star like this? Yeah, okay. So Panda's out. That's good. All right. This one has to die, though. All right. Pretty. All right. We have this one. I can't go for this, but if I swap with this, it's not too big of a deal. 
I just need this. This one should go. I did not crit. No. I'm gonna swap with this one now. Okay. Becca, I can't kill that one. Unless I swap with the N. I hit N. Alright, he's gone. The Fekka needs to be moved because he's on a glyph right now. If I don't move the Fekka, he's gonna die. But first, let me kill this, this totem. So that totem is gone now. I can do that. I was, uh. Let's Let's get these out of the um, glyph. Oh, oh yeah, the glyphs disappear, so I don't have to worry about that now. So now I can just kill the enemies. The only problem is the Fekka is already almost like the any rips is almost dead. Um can't really hit any. There. All right, I need to kill the Greedos ASAP. Oh, the yellow guys deal a lot of damage. Alright. Uh, let's buff the craw. Get these guys close. And then Frost should be able to do a lot of AoE next turn. Alright. We've got any rips uh, Almost dying. <laughs> All right, all right. Let's see how much damage the croc can do. I've got them all bunched up. A nice little accumulating arrow should do pretty well like that. Boom. And we've got... Boom. That was good. That was really good. Can Fekka kill the other one? Should be able to. Uh, 
Uh, I don't have range. There we go. Alright, the Greedos are dead. Next up, we've got the Gluco. Bro, I'm, I'm locked in the corner though. Why? Why choose me? What about this one? Oh no, I, I hear you use the MP reduction spell. What is better? The music or my gameplays? Yeah, the swap is very annoying. Yeah, yeah. I had to kill them. I can't use MP reduction. I'm playing Wulan. Chance, strength, crit. Uh, I'll show you after the Enutroph turn. It is full Wulan. It is double Ranito ring and belt for strength chance. Double queen of faith for more chance. A little bit of int as well. Good crits. Uh, Borhawk for the crit damage. Although this is a 12 AP set, you could also go with for snail met for more crits. Um, four leaf pretty standard. I've used the corruption. Because I'm using Queen of Faith, I got the Corruption Ring for the Strength Compensation. So I, Purex, I have to wait for turn 6 to, uh, to get the totems back, right? I don't get why my Fekka doesn't have AP. I'm not getting AP reduced. Maybe I do. I don't know.
Yeah, true, yeah. It's a little bit annoying. I have to wait three turns though. Cause I so everything is death by turn three. But I, I yeah. Now I just now it's just a matter of skipping my turns basically. I should probably get my characters near the near the glyphs maybe. So I can prepare to swap with the totems. Imagine if they made the fight so that you couldn't uh, kill the totems. Not on turn one, at least. Let's say the third totems would be invulnerable on turn one. That would be interesting. Yeah, I know it's manageable, but it would be insanely annoying. Alright, totems are back. So panda, if so, this is the fire totem. Where's the fire glyph, guys? Where's the fire glyph? Um, hello. The fire glyph should be somewhere there, but oh, maybe it's under the point. Yeah, 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 yeah. I see. It's this one, I think. Okay. Um. Earth is yellow. The problem is I don't have an earth. If I go like that, okay. Oh no! Wait! Why is Earth brown? Why is Earth and air swapped? Like, it doesn't make sense, right? Earth is yellow. Why is yellow not air? Air is green. Why is green not Earth? Alright. Fuck, you're 
Bye. No. Wait. Please.
Wait, it didn't end on the glyph, but that's not That's not fair. Why did it not end on... That's not fair. Okay, bro just swap with my panda to make him go on the glyph, thank you. Um, let's push the stack that way. Can't do anything. <sighs> Look at this. If you MP rape the boss, you're gonna heal him 6k. There we go. Let's go. Oh, that was a lot harder than uh, expected, to be honest. We did it. All right. That was something, guys. That was something.